the film, Mistaken for Strangers, your brother is the filmmaker, and yep. he came along on tour with you. He's nine years younger than you. Yep. You gave him the job of sort of being a roadie and a... And a uh, assistant tour manager. Assistant tour manager. manager. It was, was kind of like any any job, any title we could give him that would give it an excuse to pay him a little money to get him out of Cincinnati and out of my parents' house. And I, I was the one who encouraged him to bring a camera along. But my brother is, he, he went to film school, uh, but he's not a documentary filmmaker. And if you see the film, right. that'll become obvious pretty quick. He didn't have a plan on, on making a music doc. None of us had a plan on making a doc. Well, that's why I wanted to yeah. ask. When you brought him on tour, was there any agenda to, to have a film about the National out there? A lot of it with the agenda was I missed him. My little brother, uh, I hadn't really spent time w with him since he was like really a, a, a kid. And um, I, you know, when I, I, he was nine years old when I, when I went off to college. You know, so part of it was, was you should, we should hang out, come on tour, there, you, know, you can help out in this way or that. But I wanted him to have a camera because I thought we, we would, would almost just to, to document our, the fun we would have together. And it was. A personal, more yeah. like a f home movies. Yeah, yeah, just for, just for us. And, um, and we had a lot of fun. We, were go we goofed around a lot. It was the first time I actually was really started, like, enjoyed being on tour. Really? Because um, he, he, having him around, felt me, I felt connected. I still felt, you, get, you, get, you lose your sort of grip on, on a little bit after a few months or weeks away of, like, of your, your, your life. And, and it's just, you start to float. You start to, your brain gets a little bit uh, weird and you, 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 be, you just, just, just the, the constant anxiety of shows for shows and traveling and airports and stuff, you start to, something happens. You start to get a little, little, little strange in the head and, and having my brother around kept me sort of more connected or tethered to, to reality or what's important in life or something like that. So that was great. But all that stuff we shot, my wife looked at it and really, like, what should we do with this stuff? Maybe we could put out some funny videos. And she's like, no, it's like, it's kind of, it's cute, and it's, and, and, but it's not interesting. And then she saw, she was the one who saw a lot of footage of stuff with my brother getting drunk. I think it was when, footage of him getting drunk by himself on the bus. Right. And being a little depressed. And it was embarrassing. It's like, he's, he's, he's wasted, you know? And he's like, and he's singing to himself in the camera, and he just totally wasted. She's like... That, that I'm interested in. It ends up being my brother trying to understand his older brother because he's under, trying to understand himself and he's trying to understand why he's different than me and, 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 and what happened, like, why did I end up going this way? He ended up going that way, which at the time he thought he was a total, he saw himself as, as, a, as kind of like nothing happening in his life and everything happening in my life, you know, and which is not really the truth. But uh, then the film started be becoming about that. It was obviously that the movie is about Tom's insecurities. Uh, in you know, in the sh being kind of in the shadow of my successes, and that's where the interesting stuff was. So the the rest of the band members also, when they when they were seeing a really rough cut, they they're like, yeah, that's the movie, that's the movie. They were totally cool with it, like not right. being about the national, you know, and um, or not being so specifically about the art of of the national, you know. And we didn't need a doc like that. We didn't need something that was going to make us look cool. So. Everybody in the band kind of saw the thing that, like, because of the fact that it's two sets of brothers in, in the band, they also the, this, the fact that Doc was focusing on these right. two brothers. Right, your two guitar players are brothers, twins, twins, and then the, your bass player and drummer are brothers. Yeah, yeah. So there, the, the, when it became a, a film about family and about brothers, that's when everybody got it interested. That's when everybody's like, okay, yeah, that's that. This is this is a movie that 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 we are that it fits the national. To continue the off-camera experience, visit offcamera.com. Get full access to additional content, podcasts, and the off-camera magazine. Because the best conversations happen off-camera.